okay, I didn't actually hang out with Willie Nelson. Here's what happened. Hello world! Today we are going to the Farm Aid concert. Farm Aid is an organization that started to support local farmers and family farms by Neil Young, Willie Nelson, and John Mellencamp. I think sometime in the last 10 years. I should really have checked that, but do you know when? Willie Nelson, Neil Young, and John Mellencamp organized the first Farm Aid concert in 1985. Dave Matthews joined the board sometime in, in, in the last few years. Dave joined the board in 2001. Basically, it was an all-day show. You had, you know, people like Jerry Lee Lewis and Arlo Guthrie, who had been coming for years, and then you had people like Grace Potter and the Nocturnals, or the Elms, or Will Davey. At the very end of the night, you got to see each one of the main acts for 45 minutes to an hour. And meanwhile, you know, you could, between acts, or if you didn't necessarily want to go listen to music, there were stands of these incredible organizations that were promoting local food and co-ops and uh, fair trade and all this just really amazing causes. Um, the main one, of course, being family farms. I briefly interviewed one of the guys at the Farm Aid organization stand at the concert. Here's what he had to say. Why is it important to have family farms? Why is it because family farmers take they take care of their customers. They know who they are. Uh, they do things on a personal level. We've got so many corporate farms and they're, they're not kind to animals, they're not kind to their customers, they're in it for money. Uh, they're not in it for the love of the land, the love of the farming. Okay, and where are the family farms that they support, that Farm Aid supports? They're all over the country. 80% uh, of the family farms in, 80% of the farms in Massachusetts are family farms. Uh, but they're everywhere. Okay. And what is the musicians' participation with this? I'm sorry? What are the musicians' participations? What, what do they do? They, they, do it for, they do this for free. Uh, they come in, they, they're Willie Nelson, John Mellencamp, David, they're, they're all headliners. They come here and they play this show for free. Neil Young, uh, Pretenders. They have, they have this great base of music and people keep coming back every year. Those four, Steve Earl, coming back every year. Jerry, Jerry Lee Lewis is here for the third year in a row. With, I mean, they're, they would bring the people in. Some of the paraphernalia I acquired at the concert. The Farm Aid program, including bios of all the musicians and also a crossword puzzle. This Farm Aid event staff necklace thing. Thanks, Kate and Jen. This sign from DirecTV. The ticket, the 15th anniversary year Farm Aid compilation CD. A gaping hole in my pants just below the butt. And a little pasta salad dish. One of the things that I was wondering about when I was there was this sort of promotion of people growing food in their backyards, like tomatoes or whatever they want, really. Um, because I feel because I felt like if people started growing their own food, would we even have a need for local farmers? Would we have a need for farmers at all? So I talked to one of the homegrown.org guys, and he explained to me that the idea isn't so much to have, to tell people to grow all of their own food or to eradicate the need for farmers altogether because a that's never going to happen people aren't going to be able to grow all the produce that they that they need in the back of, of in their backyards and also because some people don't really even want to grow their foods the idea is more to connect us to the food that we eat because really when you walk into a supermarket you have no way of knowing the process that the food that you're buying went through and you certainly have no contact with the farmers who grew it so the idea with again with that is to give people more of a connection and, and sort of a, an interest in, in knowing where their food came from to begin with. And certainly with family farms, that's what happens. I mean, you, you, you know who grew it, um, you have much more of a connection with it, and so that's the idea there. Alright, so today I want to tell you about this amazing band that I discovered when I was at Farm Aid. I was sitting on the grass up at the top and this woman's voice, who is the lead singer of this band, blew me away. She just mesmerized the entire crowd, and certainly I was one of the people there who was like... And that's Grace Potter of Grace Potter and the Nocturnals. They're a band from Waitsfield, Vermont, and their music is just, just fantastic. This is their latest album. It's called This Is Somewhere. What you've just watched is the first part of a three-part series of videos. The second part is going to be interviews with some of the amazing organizations that were there. And the third part is going to be some clips of the musicians and maybe an interview or two with some really cool people.